Hello, MCTEC family. I just want to do a quick video really quick to try to thank as many people as I can for all the help that you all did and helping me trying to get this bus together. First one is, I obviously, I want to thank um, Betsy and Michelle for doing my t-shirt. So that's really, really cool. So thanks a whole bunch. Um, obviously, the biggest person I need to thank is uh, Angela Fisher and all of her help and her kids. So I do want to do a big shout out to her and, and thank you for helping me with all of this. So I've got all my flowers obviously through here. I wanna thank Mr. Farmer and his class for um, helping me be able to come up with my little models. They also helped obviously with all of the painting on all the whole bus and all the flowers. So big thank you for Mr. Farmer and his kids. And also they actually helped with some of the activities that we went through here and did. So I'll, I'll point those as we go down through. I got a leaf station right here. It gives a little bit of pictures of all the different types of, of trees and their leaves. Um, thank you, a big shout out to Mr. Bay who let me use his laminator so that we could laminate all of that. Um, I've got a station here about, I talked to the kids a little bit about the different types of um, where food actually comes from. I've got a blueberry plant, raspberry plant, and then we talk about canning a little bit. So shout out to um, Patty Furrow for letting me have some old canning um, jars that she had. Um, this station here is about tree rings and all the different types of tree rings and how they can count and um, figure out the age of a tree. And so big shout out to Daryl who cut them all down for us. And then once again, Angie's kids who actually sanded them and then polyurethaned them. Um, also, a shout out to Angie's and a little bit of help from Mr. May, who showed us how to use mortar to be able to make these little uh, plant holders. So, shout out to them. Um, on down, I have a frost station here that um, shows the kids a little bit about frost and, and the chart that goes along with that. I talk a little bit about that. Got the Venus fly trap and also my succulent garden here. Um, and then a big shout out to Mr. Jones who actually printed these all off with his 3D printer, the succulents. Um, on down, I have a little station here that helps them identify some of the insects. Uh, Mr. Farmer's class helped me come up with this idea and so we can count the legs on the insects or the arachnids and so on. Down here I've got my little um, water garden, my little pond, and so I use little fishing um, magnets to be able to let the kids go fishing and then Mr. Farmer actually helped me a little bit with um, coming up with the fish to be able to put in there so the kids could could um, spell out some um, words. The rest of these are all like garden plants so uh, obviously Miss Fisher helped me a lot with this and trying to get all of these planted up from seed. Our cucumbers came from seed um, and the tomatoes came from seed. These actually we bought from Lowe's so there you go. All right, this is tacky petunia. And so we use this as a recycle, um, a chance to be able to show the kids how to recycle. So um, thanks to everybody who helped me put this together. Cosmetology actually um, decorated our pretty face here and gave her some hair. So that's great. Um, and then uh, Mr. Farmer's class helped me a little bit with trying to get all of this together. Um, this is an aquaponics unit that's Miss Fisher's and so this I show the kids to show all the fish and how we pump the water up into the top unit to be able to feed the um, plants across the top. And this of course you all may know um, this is um, little peanut. She's sleeping right now and um, once again this is Miss Fisher's uh, one of her pets so she's she's uh, she's living amongst all of this. <laughs> We've got a whole unit here of micro bits, so I, I use a little bit of my coating that I did with some of the kids in the elementary before, and we use the micro bits to see this, the soil temperature and the moisture level of those. This was another idea that Mr. Farmer and I came up with with the presidential green th thumb, sorry. And so with this, we actually um, try to match the names of the presidents with their pictures and then what they actually were known for, why they were, um, as a president what they actually grew. Then I've got my uh, butterflies here and my worms down in the very bottom. And so I am trying to um, get them going. Hopefully they'll be butterflies soon. And then the last one is the hydroponics. This is our hydroponics unit that we show the kids how the, um, the roots grow down through the water um, and how we can grow them uh, using the hydroponics system. And then this is the pump and the tank that we actually use it through. 
So if I forgot, oh, Mr. Adams actually helped me back there with the um, with the fish tank and making me a brace that goes around it so it can travel um, well. Um, Mr. Barton also, actually his class painted these boards for me so that I could put those on there. Um, if I forgot somebody, it was not intentional. I truly, truly thank everybody. This has been a great group effort. So um, I really appreciate you guys. Thanks a whole bunch. And I'll see you again. <laughs>